This chair being made in Benin. If these people make the chair, the carpenter, the same place is the factory. You saw the factory. We can walk a little bit for the factory. Yeah, it's the one for off of. It has many wood factory here. It's one. I do piece also with this carpenter. And I wish this kind of crafting also in my installation because it's part also for the daily life. I start asking myself where the Africa contemporary art and where I can show my work. I think maybe it don't exist. It's not just subject for me. It's subject for many artists so Africa try to make the contemporary thing. But I take the decision to create this museum. Yeah, I build the museum because I think I look space for my work. And this African contemporary museum was my fantasy start being reality. I just have ideas. Then people help me to build up and to build up. The 12 room for this museum, it grew up in many different spaces. It was built up around the wall. You find everything you can find in every museum. You find a book in museum. You can find a restaurant in museum. You can eat here. You have a museum shop. And the thing you can never find in Tate Real Museum, you can find in my museum. You have a money space. You have a game room. I chose religion room because I think Everywhere you have a ritual, everywhere around the world. It can be Masonic ritual, or it can be animist ritual. But when you look at my religion rule, you see the religion come from everywhere. Nowadays, I don't know, okay, in Europe is not fashion anymore, but in Africa, everybody is Christian. But everybody has many religions behind it. I propose the wedding room. It was my own wedding. At the same time, it makes me to talk also the way that everything is missing now. It's not just have fun and make marriage museum. They have made behind it. The world moves in this way. Take two African people, maybe her ancestors come from Nigeria or Ethiopia, and now this person is from Benin, you know. The moment I make the Museum of Contemporary for African Art, you know, I collect many books. And we decided to bring the book in Benin because find art book in Europe is more easy, more in Africa, you know. Yeah, I'm happy you see little bit of the city for Cotonou. It's a nice city, but it's a city we don't really have an art school. Here is uh, Africa Contemporary Bibliothek uh, Library. I share what I have with the public. And when you look, we still look for the book because you see many shelves look quite empty, no full. So uh, I can with your film to say people need to give offer or more book. The idea for my work for my life. Okay, the Africa I know, a lot of people don't know this Africa, or the Africa I come from, a lot of people don't know this Africa.